Hello there, and thanks for joining me. Well, I didn't think I would do that, but I got the Jedi Fallen Order. So, um, let's try the game. Uh, the reviews on Steam are pretty miserable right now because of the performance problems. Uh, some of that was to be expected, but, you know, it seems to be really bad. I haven't tried it yet. I just finished downloading it. And, um, I'm playing with the recommended settings. Um, that the game set up it like was loading for a while saying like it was optimizing the game files so I don't know what this will look like so let's get started and play the game the next generation of Jedi we seek a dangerous fugitive this is no common anarchist but a devotee of the treasonous Jedi Order. No! Look at this, a lightsaber. I was alone for a long time. I was scared that they'd find out who I was or what I was. And you're not alone, not anymore. Yeah, even though I didn't play the game, the first game all the way through, I realized this is a recap of the first game. So let's watch that. I spent years waiting for a chance to avenge my sisters. I know what it's like to lose everything. Night sisters and Jedi do not travel together, but survivors, we adapt. The fate of the Jedi Order lies in your hands. Life has this funny way of forcing you on the path forward. Execute Order 66. Every Jedi faces the dark side. We could build something different. Something better. She'll sell you out too. You can't stop the Empire! I'm stronger now because of the pain. Such hatred. Failure is not the end. It is a necessary part of the path. Hope will always survive in those who continue to fight. I will never forget. I will honor your teaching and your sacrifice. By the right of the Council, Cal Kestis, rise, Jedi Knight. Remember, trust only in the Force. So where to now? guess that was the ending of the first game i didn't play that much i liked the graphics and i liked the fact that you know you started pretty quickly um you know that you didn't have to wait like three hours before you um like get your first force ability or something but um i eventually after like two days of playing the first game i kind of lost you know <laughs> i, I it wasn't fun anymore um, because I got sick and tired pretty soon of all the parkouring and climbing and running along walls. Um, there was I liked the combat, uh, I liked the s graphics and the story, but there were too many of these uncharted Tomb Raider-like riddles. I know this game probably will have the same, but maybe it will be more fun. I can't really tell you why I didn't enjoy the first game why i you know stopped playing it but i just you know it was too much parkouring too many riddles with nothing you know with not enough of the other stuff so let's see how this whole game will do and i am gonna i guess i'm gonna play as a jedi knight uh, which I guess is the normal difficulty. You can see um, the things that change if you change the difficulty setting. The parry timing goes up, so you get a bigger parry window. The incoming damage goes down and the aggression as well. And if you play the story mode, you get huge parry windows and hardly any incoming damage or any aggression. So let's stick with Jedi Knight and see how that goes. Hold on. Yeah, Jedi Knight. Okay. Um, force interaction here on default on. We'll display on screen button prompt to indicate which force ability is required. Navigation hands. Display an extra navigation beacon for puzzle. The main objectives can be turned on off at any time. I'm going to try it out. 
and uh, let's see uh, dialogue line skip in conversation pressing a skips ahead to the next half dialogue does not affect cinematics well since this since i'm gonna show you some impressions of the game and you know what i'm gonna turn it on i'm not just not gonna use it so for this first impression video for the first gameplay i'm not gonna skip any dialogue and let's see how good the dialogue is this time so once again thanks for joining and let's see what this game does Oh, those are some pretty cool textures on those clothes. The corduroy jeans, whatever type stuff. Looks good. That's an oddly long scene. <laughs> Yeah, you can tell he's gotten quite a bit older, a couple of years. So let's see what else has changed. sound right yeah I guess so Don't quite know what the game set the uh, graphic options to, but uh, yeah, I guess it lowered. It went low on the textures and everything, the details. I'm gonna take a look in a little while once I get to control my character. Good, well, that's looking decent. Getting some Arkham City type wipes here. Oh, let me take a real quick look at. Uh, where are the options? There we go. Um, visuals. So it set everything to medium. And window full screen. Oh, what if I set it to high? Let's try that. Yeah, 
Yeah, that's what I liked about the first game as well. They really nailed that Star Wars look with everything looking kind of old and used and worn. Instead of like highly polished like you've seen in so many Sans franchises in the past. So yeah, but of course, you know, it would be really stupid to not do that when you're doing a Star Wars game. Scout Troopers. Hey, I've seen him in a gameplay clip. That's looking pretty nice. Can't really tell how the frame rate is doing, but let's see what happens when the combat begins. Which it should pretty soon, I guess. Okay, we're gonna continue and walk for a little one over two miles or something. This little loincloth there. When the senator gets a hold of you, you'll wish you were dead. Always nice to meet a fan. This way, Jedi. Ouch. Once again, detail on the clothes look pretty good. Yes, it better be. Ada's dogs are always sniffing about. Jedi is a rare quarry these days. So here's the villain speech, right? You brought me. See that he is paid. Renegade Jedi Cal Kestis. You have made quite a name for yourself. Sabotaging weapons depots, disrupting supply lines, flaunting this for everyone to see. The failed coup on Norset. That was your doing, wasn't it? What do you want, Senator? Confession? You already know I've been working with Saul Guerrero. Before I deliver you to the Emperor, you will lead me to the remaining Jedi. I can't. It's just me. <laughs> no use resisting. I'll find out one way or another. Sometimes all it takes is a speech. But in there, I have other tools at my disposal. Or maybe I'll just use this! Your master's lightsaber. Jaro Tapar. A traitor like you. And to think one day our children will 
mask. What is this thing? This relic of a corrupt institution destroyed by its own arrogance. Arrogance is a trap a lot of us fall into, Senator. I'm sure the Emperor won't mind if I deliver you to him in pieces! What? Did you really think you could capture me? You've got classified military intel stored on your yacht. And you just brought it right to me. Thanks, BD. Okay, so I guess uh, we're gonna commence the butt kicking right now. <laughs> okay. Alrighty. That's a cool tutorial with that with those you know, time stops. Come and get me. Nice. That all you got, Senator? Come on out. We'll talk. Okay. In the name of the Empire. All right, so that's dodging. Blocking. Actually, that finisher move. While he was doing that, I was pressing the uh, block button. Ah, okay, that's why. Thought the game froze on me. Not so fast, Senator. Okay, so I guess now it's some recurring now. No. Now he comes to us. Uh, he's coming a little high. Oh, really high! Hold on. Yeah, there's... it's gonna start now. It's okay. These things happen. We gotta get to that yacht. That was a close one, buddy. Oh yeah, just like in the first game, you have these these type of things where you can always climb up. Looking pretty amazing, but I hope it's not like these in, these incredibly long sequences where I have to do that for like several minutes trying to find like the right path, and there's only one of them. Because as I said, I like the first game. I like the combat in it. Um. I would have liked to see more of the story, but then, you know, it was like another overly long riddle. Which was more like Tomb Raider or um, Uncharted. And I got tired of that eventually. Okay, it's a little lag in there. What's that? Do you? Okay, I can't open that. He doesn't have anything for that, does he? Hey, buddy. Nice. You gotta find that yacht before the Empire does. Is it safe up here? You're gonna just obey a direct command? Find the bomb! Affirmative! Okay. Wow. Cool. Senators got stashed. Hope it's worth the risk. You never give up hope, do you, buddy? Yeah, it does look pretty good, I have to admit that. 
reminds me of the beginning of the first game as well when you when there was that accident and you had to save that other guy which meant that people realized that you were a Jedi we can rest there ah safe spot bonfire Okay, lunging strike is what I'm supposed to learn. There we go. Hold Y. Oh, I like I always like these little tutorials. I mean, <laughs> it's kind of self-explanatory, but for I guess more advanced skills, it'd be good to have these little clips. That looks cool. Oh, well, should I rest? Yeah, let's rest real quick. So, let's continue. Oh, let me try that attack. Okay. What are we looking for? Suspect's nail. Was last seen on Dock 27. Yeah, that's pretty forceful. Ready to move on? I'm gonna get you. <laughs> yeah, I always get nostalgic when I see the um the scout troopers. I loved them when I was a kid and watched uh, Return of the Jedi for the first time. I also had the Kenner action figures. I just love the look of those guys. Oh, it's that map. I hated that map, sorry. <laughs> okay, yellow gateways lead to unexplored areas. Green elements indicate available pathways, while red is blocked. Okay. Uh, yeah, that map. I mean, it looks cool that they tried to do the hologram type map, but I thought sometimes it was confusing in the first game. And I heard that, I read at least one review of this game where the guy said the same thing. It still is. Sure. Go oh, cool. That's new, I think. Cool. Oh yeah, I remember that. That was always fun. The uh, parrying, deflecting. All right. <laughs> nice. Throw me Yeah. Okay, I can block. I think I can parry it. With the saber, uh, I mean melee attacks, only shots. Nice. That's not as well, I think. <coughs> yeah, that was pretty silly. Close 
closer. Hanging in there, BD? Don't look down. Yeah, that's my friend, right? Or did I just mind control him? I don't know. Ah, it's a good old Lando Calrissian move, right? Yeah. What took you so long? Oh, you know, just hanging out. <clears throat> Taking in the sights. Been a while since I was on Coruscant. Huh. Mm. Thanks, Boat. Part of the job, Gestus. When I saw the dock collapse, I thought this heist might be over real quick. Why make it easy for him? Ah, where's the crew? Heading to the yacht. We'll meet him there. Oh, and Bravo said no comms. No comms it is. Bravo knows best. Coop and Liz are probably starving by now. Hungry Klaatuinians. Ooh. Don't want that. Remind me to tell you about the Corita job sometime. Looks like that factory stopped the yacht. I call that a win. No gunships. The crew must be making mischief. Let's not keep them waiting. How are we gonna get you across? Down that crate. Worth a shot. All right. But how do I use it? There. Hmm. It's no prompt either. Let me try that. Ah, there we go. I had to jump right at the beginning. That jetpack's handy. Remind me to tell you how I got it sometime. I fell. He got me back on my feet. Sounds like a good teacher to me. Stormtrooper patrol. Yeah, that Jedi flip is pretty Ross. cool. Better us than the yacht, yeah? There was th that kind of stuff was in the first game as well, but I think they really upped their game a little bit with that. Seems to be that you have more moves like that. See that cable? On it, Kestis. Okay, I guess there will be a lot of parkouring passages long one. But let's see how it goes. Bucket heads below. No going around them. Then we go through them. Already when you are, Kestis. Yeah, I've seen that. Got it some hostiles. Got a hostile. Go take them down. Hey, fellas. 
We'll do this together. Come on, shoot again. Nicely done. Back at you. We can call the lift with that terminal. On it. Troopers coming. Let's get the drop on him. Sure thing. On your signal. Speak binary, but I hear you, BD. Team effort. The yacht's just over there. And of course, the bridge is under construction. Let's try up that way. Quit reading my mind, Jedi. Could have broke one of those jetpacks along, you know? All set. Okay. Ouch. <laughs> Another safe spot. Well, let me see if I have any of the other stanzas. I have to adjust the uh, resolution as well because I think on uh, the video uh, the edges are going to be cut off a tiny bit. Almost close. Speaking of trouble, let's avoid that patrol. Agreed. Enemies close. We've got an intruder here. It's up to them. Oh, Probe droids. Same here. Hey, an intruder! Look at this situation tactically! More coming! Dodging! Could use some help, buddy. That did the trick. Can't go down there. Can't write. Got nothing to interact with right now. So yeah. What am I supposed to do? Let's check the map. Okay, there's supposed to be something I can interact with. Oh, can I reach those? I can. Wow. Didn't see them at first. <laughs> yeah, of course. Nice. Oh, 
Yeah, I still have to get used to the dodging. But the deflecting is pretty fun. I liked that in the first game as well. Dead end. Let's double back. I like the audio design, I have to say. Feels like a big city. Sounds like one as well. So I have to go that way. That looks like a 50 soul timer. Pretty cool. To him. Room is dim, bud. That was a weird rest. position to die in. Alright, so. Oh, okay. you to knock that down. <laughs> now I'm taking orders from a droid. <laughs> the Emperor turned the Jedi Temple into his palace. Yeah, that's what the Empire does best. Take something you love and make it something you can't stand the sight of anymore. Oh, that was another close call there. Next time I hope he'll just bring another jetpack, but of course he won't. Okay, so... I can tell you impressed him. That isn't easy. I'm good at what I do, and I don't ask the wrong question. Imagination tends to open doors. Nope. Yeah, had to push forward to get more momentum, not swing. We might be able to use that crane to get across the bridge. Hmm. Using the Empire's tools against him. So why was was I given the path that leads me further away from the crane? It's kind of weird. Ah, okay. 
Oh, that's the same position as before. That's where the old timer was. So let's see. Got some company, and it isn't friendly. I forgot to keep to uh, ask the guy to attack. Okay, new skill point. Down something. I can hack, right? Oh, of course. It's a mini bus, right? And I got no heals anymore. Find something, buddy? What's he got? Ascension cable. Worker sees him for construction now. Can you repair it? <laughs> ah, okay. I know where this leads. Cable's a bit frayed. Not in bad shape. Should be a quick patch job. Hmm. <sighs> so I heard you fought the Empire on Kashyyyk. Let me guess, the repair is yeah. going to take just as long as that conversation, Walker, right? And broke open an Imperial prison camp single-handed. That one was BD. Just the two of you. And some friends. What about you, new guy? Win this for the credits? The credits never hurt. But, uh... I have a daughter. Got it. I don't get to see her as often as I'd like, but at least I can provide for her. Must be hard being away from her. Mm -hmm. I love how we're in. She's gone. Uh, like dangerous areas and showing you showing me like baby pictures, kid pictures, Sorry. or holograms. <laughs> Taking a lot of people. More every day. You ever use one of those? I'll figure it out. It was a scrapper on Braca. <laughs> You've been through a lot for someone so young. Just trying to survive. Yeah, that was the beginning of the first oh, game, God. right? The scrapper thing. That's how, the, how that game began. All right. Uh, there we go. Another new ability. Side of her employers. Okay, well, am I really supposed to go there? Yes. Wow. Bravo used to fly for the Republic. Her 
Mark's military. <laughs> oh, okay. The more complete that circle is, the clo the more the close I am to be able to to grapple. Friends ever since. So let's see. It seems like I'm supposed to actually go there. Okay, it's that bar again. I actually went the wrong way then. Didn't I? I did. Okay, I can from up there. Oh yeah, that's a safe spot there. Right, so let's rest. Let's spend one more let's spend my skill point and regarding skills we have lightsaber, survival and the force. Let's take a look. I could theoretically take resilience, which gives me more max life. I could go for Cyclone Clash, Improved Footwork, oh, okay, I can reflect like two uh, blaster projectiles, and you can use different stances I heard, but uh, the game kind of encourages you to um, specialize, and I think I would like to go uh, eventually for um, Two-handed, like two single-handed ones. So, what do we do? Let's let's give us a little bit more HP for now, and then check out the cool abilities a little later. So yeah, my impression so far, it looks good. Can't really say much about the performance. I did see some frame rate drops. But, um, I like it so far. It will take me a little while to get used to the combat. Uh, using the new abilities and same with the parkour. But, um, I'm actually looking forward to trying out more of this. As long as it's not another game where you have like 30 minute parkour passages trying to find like a, the, the only correct way up somewhere. But, I'm looking forward to trying this more. And the combat thing is pretty cool. Wow. Pretty neat. So, thanks for watching, and I'm sure I'll soon share some more gameplay and some more impressions. And uh, until then, uh, may the decent performance be with you, may the frame rate be high, and uh, may the force be with you. So, talk to you soon. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.